Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pink has got to blow up. <laughs> Man, do you want to just sit it on there for a bit? Oh, it'd be a laugh. Is it still in there? Like, it's checked he has a stall on it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll sit it on there. Oh, it'd be Put good. Put it on there, then I'll take a photo I, for the oh, Instagram. Yeah. And it comes to the scroll. Do you want to? Yeah, sure. All right. How heavy is it? It's pretty fucking heavy. Do you want to lift? All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in today's video, we are going to start ripping the motor out of Pinky. It's been quite a while since we've done any uploads. Anyway, uh, Craig is nearly here. He's got Pinky on the back of the car, which is still like as it left Summonat, so it's running and driving. Um, the plan is to take that motor out of Pinky. We're going to whack it back into Cuddles and we are building Pinky another motor which is gonna go back in its place. It's not done yet, but um, probably in another video, we're gonna show you where we're at uh, with that motor. Um, so those of you who've seen the old videos will know um, what we're planning on building, big solid roller combination, etc., etc. So um, that's very exciting for me anyway. I love that shit. But anyway, we'll wait for uh, Craig with uh, Pinky to rock up and we'll go down and say good day. Here old Pinky's got a bit of an exhaust leak, which <laughs> sounds funny. We'll, we'll show you uh, show you when she gets up, when she gets up here. But it's here. Um, so we're just gonna figure out if we're gonna whack it in um, whack it in the garage or if we're gonna take it up top and take the engine out there because a few logistical issues with that, you know? So we'll... We are here with Craig, Damo. We're uh, pulling the motor out of Pinky. Um, we've already got the intake manifold off. The boys are pretending to do work because the fucking video's on now. <laughs> um, but yeah, here's a look. If you just want to look at the, the mad ports on this bad boy, uh, show you what we're working with here. Uh, full race port job, you know how it is. Holy, look at that. <laughs> Little bits and pieces of pink in there. But, um, oh, there's a really good shot of the uh, perfection. Perfection that you call, oh, look at that. Look at that, that's a good shot. Oh yeah. So you can tell a professional done that. And right down near the valve, you can see the actual good bit, which is um, the bit that I had paid to get done, which is the important bit. It's the bit around the re around the valve, um, really helps like low lift flow and all that. And it is, in my opinion, the reason why this motor makes so much power is because of these heads and because of all the work that we did to the valves and the valve like de-shrouding all around it and all that. Here's a look at the plug. So this is fresh from Summonats. Almost a little, probably a little lean maybe, I don't know. Yeah, she's a little bit rusty, that's okay. A bit of moisture in there. Bit of moisture in there. And that's what happens with these methanol cars. It picks up the moisture out of uh, the air and it sort of goes into the fuel and as you're burning it, you know, if some gets left in the cylinder or whatever, something to be aware of. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go do something now. I'm not going to add it into this video, but if you follow Craig on Instagram, you'll see. Uh, for those of you, for those of you who uh, just follow us on YouTube, um, you're just gonna have to wait, but there is a surprise coming. But anyway, um, we'll go do that now. We'll cut back in once, once we've got the, getting the motor out. Righto, well we've had a bit of lunch and we are just finishing up on Pinky. We've pulled out uh, the motor. So we've got Cuddle's motor there. Um, now we're gonna pull out the fuel pump and the MSD, um, which is funny because uh, with Craig's new combo, we're gonna just be putting back in a <laughs> MagnaFuel ProStar 500 and an MSD ignition controller. But um, Craig's purchased all new gear for that, so that's all that fresh gear is going to go in. Um, not today, we're just 
purely ripping out the motor today and um, so we can make a start on sort of swapping everything over and getting cuddles back up and running and all that. Um, we are building Craig a new motor which um, there'll be another video on but basically we're not able to get the parts in time from the US. Um, so actually today I'm filming a second video which will be up later on that new motor because we're obviously still going to Rocky Nats. We just can't do it with this big solid roller, high comp, you know, rod and piston combo that we were going to run. We're going to be building a slapper. Craig loves slappers. Slapper time. Hell yeah. It's like a party engine. Yeah. Who cares what happens to it? We can just rev the shit out of it. <laughs> so we got to pull it apart and build another one anyway. So. That's exactly right. So <laughs> there is something about it. You know, those of you who've done it before, you'll know. There's something about a party engine that yeah. just gets gets your blood going, okay, you know. It's like a little lower. Yeah. And you can just... Not as much on the line. Yeah. Um, they're easy to build. You know, they obviously work well. The, the engine yeah. that's... In cuddles is so basically else, yeah. a slapper. Um, it basically be the exact same setup, just a slightly bigger cam. Yeah, literally. Apart from that, everything else is like identical. The whole top end, so that top end that's sitting over there, um, Craig's going to use. So that's the 950 quick fuel methanol carb with the two inch spacer and the Edelbrock Victor Senior manifold. Um, we'll match up to his heads and um, it'll be a stock, stock bottom end and we're gonna fly cut the pistons. Um, we'll probably take 50 thou out of the piston um, so that we can run that cam and rev it up, no worries. And yeah, so that'll be in a future future video. Um, for now, we just sort of wanted to show you guys that we are starting to work on the cars and you know, we've still got a massive, what is it, four weeks to go. Four, four and a half weeks, I think. I think it's like 30 days or something, isn't it? Yeah. Jesus. So that's all good. We just build two cars start to finish in 30 days. But no worries. Um, but yeah. So there's the update. Craig's just undoing all the all the AN fittings and that. We just drained the tank. Um, so it's still the methanol, methanol in it from Summonats. So, got all that out, motor's out, I'm not sure if we've given like a, a little rundown on the, on the motor, some of you guys wouldn't have seen it, you would have seen in the older videos and that, she's pretty basic, you got the SFI balancer on the front there, um, Castle Main Rod Shop conversion um, for early girls, you got the uh, Rod Shop uh, engine mount got a new alternator with just a very basic sort of uh, pulley set up there with a 25% underdrive balancer Craig's um, man I thought that was going to skewer your car for a sec there right? <laughs> lucky it's all still together um, that's Craig's water pump on there um, that's a really nice Mezier Mezier <laughs> uh water pump so yeah that's yeehaw glen mcgrath yeah. put it all back in here eventually put it all back in it's filthy as yeah Got some cleaning to do cleaning and straightening you like you like him dirty i do mm -hmm. dirty slapper <laughs> 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 Fucking love these stickers, man. Methanol fuel. Yeah, first time. Getting More you should run methanol. I don't understand why people don't, to be quite honest. Like, it's for what we do, man, it's perfect. Yeah. It's like the fuel. E85, like, yeah, but so many more benefits with, with methanol and there's none of the fucking negatives. Yeah, I don't want to hear it about the maintenance and stuff. Like, if you're not up for maintenance, why do you have a skid car? Why do you have an event car if you can't maintain... Nah, I'm going to cut that bit out. I sound like a fucking preacher. <laughs> anyway. Um, 
Run meth, it's good. Have a go at this, we have a blowout here, bro. Yeah. Under there, there's all like uh I had to get a boots full of rubber. Yeah. I got it all sprayed up. That was Pinky's fab work. Pinky's fabrication. Yeah. Oh, oh that. Yeah, huh? Anyway. You can see how much like pressure it is when it lets go, because that's blowing the lab up. Oh, okay. It's actually yeah, that was should have all been flat. From that was it flat before? Yeah. Before Simon Yeah, from the um yeah, the tub back here, it was all like that level. Oh. So you can see she's blown up. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I had to just get something in there just because otherwise there's a big hole in there. Yeah, right. So there was a piece in there, which I don't know where that went. That's someone else. Yeah. Yeah, it's had a bit of uh, modifications in there. Mm hmm. And it held up. Really. We'll have to get your, um, you won't even know. your insane fab skills <laughs> back at it, bro. Fix that up. Couple of text screws. Yeah, just smash a few back through. <laughs> Fucking no worries. But you can tell it works. Works great. Yeah, well, I'm really good at what I do. <laughs> like a first year apprentice? <laughs> <laughs> bro. <laughs> that, uh, I don't know. Man, you and me both. I probably, I probably stopped That's my friend. That. <laughs> That's exactly what Cuddle's boot looks like, man, <laughs> as well. Like, literally that. Yeah, and there was a bung, I don't know, a bung in there, which that's probably where everything comes from. Yeah, a little plastic one. Yeah. yeah. Alright, so fuel pumps out. She's a big hooah. Got that out. And we're just getting the, the wiring loom out in the MSD. Which is probably all zip tied all together and yeah. very, very securely ta <laughs> attached. <laughs> there we have it pinky all loaded up we've taken the fuel pump out the msd ignition controller and the motor um so pinky's gonna go away now um probably for about two weeks uh and that's gonna give us time to build his new motor um which we have uh almost fully disassembled now we need to get it cleaned um we've got pretty much everything there to build it um including craig's new we're, we're literally putting in the same pump the same ignition controller um it's almost the same motor <laughs> um for rocky nuts and then in the background we'll be building that big motor um which is literally at the moment just waiting for parts to rock up um but yeah, so that's the update, guys. Um, we're now going to go and work on this motor or do something. Cuddles is coming along, still doing the bodywork to it. Very boring stuff. So I haven't really been sort of videoing much of that, but we're nearly done on that. The wrap will go on. The motor will go back in. We're going to have a look at the motor again and just sort of see if we can do anything quick while it's out and sort of freshen it up. That'll go back in and um, that'll be that. So thanks very much for watching guys. Uh, yeah, we've got heaps coming up. Like the next probably four or five weeks is gonna be a lot on. Um, we're all going to Rocky and we're all very keen, but um, there's a lot to do. So stay tuned for that shit and uh, we'll uh, be seeing you on the next one. Hey Craig. See you. So, oh, man, that's a mad zoom. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Peace guys.